Is Money Point very popular here? It's very, very popular. Why? Yeah, because it's the best banking experience so far so. in terms of transaction, the reference, everything. Money Point is the best view. Its network was fast, everything was good. There's nothing like a decline. There's nothing like a reversal of a transactions. Reconciliation made easy. Why did you want to get Money Point? I want to get it because you told me that it's very fast time transaction. Okay. Uh, Compared to this other one here yes, that you have. Yes. Okay. Money Point is a good, is a good network. There's a fintech battle in Nigeria, and one company appears to be winning. I got that you for free at Cispan in Nigeria. Money Point is responsible for processing more than 50% of the total transaction that happens on QS terminal in the country. To understand why, I hit the streets of Lagos, Nigeria. Here at this market, point-of-sale agents are everywhere, and the majority of them are using these light blue devices. MoneyPoint has millions of point-of-sale terminals in use across the country, which power Nigeria's offline economy. And while there are many competitors in this space, MoneyPoint, which processed $182 billion for customers in 2023, appears to be beating them all. But how did they do it? How did MoneyPoint grow so quickly? And why has it become the preferred choice for agents and merchants across Nigeria? The agents using Ox, they make more profits when they use money points. That's Ezekiel Sani. He leads distribution and offline sales for money point. And the cool thing about Ezekiel is he started as an agent before rising through the ranks of the company. Basically, I started with money points mid-2019 as an agent. The friend that introduced me to Money Point contacted me, informing me about uh, Money Point going nationwide, and I applied and I became state coordinator at those states. And a couple of years and promotions later, I'm the senior vice president, distribution network say, yeah, at Money Point. So Ezekiel understands from experience what problems agents and merchants face and what they want from their point of sale devices. Prior to Money Point, right? We have issues with uptime. It has been like an industry wide issue. Reliability is one of the most important criteria for users. Especially for the agents, right? The agents, their business involved a quick turnaround. They have limited cash and they want to quickly turn this around so that they can make more profits. Mm -hmm. And we have this issue of their cash or their phone being trapped. So in addition to building a more reliable product and making it easier to initiate requests for refund when there are failed transactions, MoneyPoint has also introduced a number of product features, such as instant settlements. We have this issue of uh, merchants and agents not getting their funds settled on time. What the conventional banks, what they offer is T plus one, which is transaction day locks one. Mm -hmm. So if a merchant or a customer uses his or a card on a POS terminal at a merchant's location, the merchant will not get settled until the next day. So Money Point came in with instant settlements, right? You are getting your money real time as you are transacting. The agents and merchants Money Point services are small businesses that use these point of sale terminals as a tool to help them grow. So the entry point is business account. That is like the foundation for all every other products. The point of sale can be assigned to that business account. Expense card can be assigned to the business account. And once you start using the business accounts, you're qualified to get a working capital loan. In Nigeria's fintech battle, many merchants or agents will have multiple devices from different companies, which they will have opened or which they use depending on incentives offered. Like, let me say from the beginning, when you are starting. Yeah. Because if you want to collect this one, at times they will give you conditions that you know meet up the target of collecting the money points. Okay. This one now, I bought it, doesn't have any condition. While some fintechs and banks choose to offer discounts on the device or structure their pricing to boost customer acquisition, Money Point wants to incentivize utilization. There is a certain amount that is set aside as cash back to the agents. So apart from the fact that they make more profits with our pricing, they have the rebate is there. And when they do more with our terminals, they get more cash back. Mm -hmm. So they want to go for it. Now, in a market like Nigeria, companies like Money Point need to employ a strong ground game, leveraging a field team to play a crucial role in distribution as well as sales and support. 
How many people do you work with here? How many agents? Like, I'm giving for today just two. Okay. For today, I'm but in general, how many do you look after? 50. That's Emmanuel, a member of Money Point's field team, who we happened to bump into as he was going to onboard a new customer in the market. We are Rema, uh, foot soldiers. We are for business relationship managers. So they interface with the merchants and our agents daily. They are literally in the feed, being it during sunshine and during rain. They are there trying to get business owners on board MoneyPoint platform. They don't just stop at selling. They also provide first level of support to, to the business owner. And MoneyPoint leverages this kind of incentivization to not only increase utilization of their devices, but also to boost the productivity of their team in the field. One thing that I've contributed to this effectiveness is around the commission they earn as incentives. So the six team, they basically look at, them, at themselves as entrepreneurs and they are willing to go all out and get this job done. We have gotten that right and we have improved on it. And that is why you see that every corner you go in Nigeria, you will see a terminal. So how, when does it go through the sound? Thanks for watching The Flip. If you like this episode, please hit that subscribe button.